Hey, what's up guys, Aaron here, and welcome back to the 2021 Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. But there is a hundred times this slipstream, and no dirty air. Now, Yas Marina, over the years, it's been the, the scene of an F1 finale, a championship decider, even a few times. But it's not always been the best circuit. I mean, look at 2010, that championship decider was, you know, pretty much highly influenced by the fact you can't overtake at this circuit sometimes, depending on the circuit circumstances. We've had a few, uh, you know, pretty boring Grand Prix at this circuit. Now, I know we've got a new layout. That may change things, and we'll, I guess we'll find out tomorrow if we're gonna, you know, have an exciting championship finale with Verstappen v Hamilton. But can we improve the original Yas Marina circuit, the one we've got on the F1 game right now, by just upping the slipstream and removing all the dirty air? Well, today, we're gonna find out. We've got a five-lap race around Yas Marina. We're going to drive as George Russell in the Williams P20 here, but due to this slipstream and lack of dirty air, you are going to see we will be fighting, my, my words, for the race win today in this Williams. We'll be giving George Russell today a taste of what he can expect, maybe potentially if Mercedes are still going to be good next year, next season in 2022 in that Mercedes car by fighting at the forefront, but we're going to do it in the Williams because this is an equaliser. This is going to be the great equaliser for the entire F1 grid. Here we go then to five red lights to one of the most unique Abu Dhabi Grand Prix you're going to see as the lights are out and we're on the way. Now initially you're not going to see the real effect of what we've done here today apart from maybe that wobbling of the suspension. That may give an inkling of the speed we're going to be having on the straight but you can see the last Lack of dirt here, allowing me just to breeze through, accelerate midway through the corner. The damage is, uh, you know, very, very weak just because, obviously, you can see the closing speed. It's ridiculous. So, I think everyone's going to need this lack of damage. It's basically like bumper cars, essentially. And if you're uh, an older viewer, you may kind of realize this is basically Formula Ascot. Anyway, let's get on with the action as we catch up to Raikkonen. Buffeting, buffeting on the front. Oh, my God. It's four abreast. And we're going to catch the tail end of Vettel. We need to stick with the pack. It's crucial. We may have a hundred times slipstream. May, there, there, there may be no dirty air, but we need to crucially be within the toe of these cars. But I mean, up the road, look at this. Look at the effect of it. It is literally five wide from this view from the ground. Can you imagine being in this grandstand crowd and seeing this? Uh, that. Now that's biblical. Look at it. It's like a swarm of bees going through. Even this section, we didn't need to new kit Formula 1. We just needed this. Right, gaining on them. They're going to go slow. Side by side moments. We're going to go get in the middle of this. Lovely little move there on the Aston. Going to try and get Sonoda where he can. P13. Down the inside of two cars. It's P11. We are going well. Good progress here. I told you. I told you we're going to be fighting for the top as we go around the outside of Ocon. And what a move on Daniel Ricciardo. We have absolutely done him. The hotel section becomes raceable. Look at this. Lovely stuff there. We're getting held up a little bit by Gasly. That's because I can't find the room to work with. There's a massive train. Here we go. Now we go down the inside. Easy does it. Okay. P6. We're living. Lando. Come on, mate. Bump draft. Bump draft for, dr for dreams. For glory. Into turn one. Hamilton's through. Hamilton. My future teammate as we drive as George Russell. He's struggling here in this new formula. The other guys are getting away, though. We need to actually catch back up. And my God, that vibration of the front is actually mad. Like, it's actually ridiculous how little you can see due to the suspension travel, right? We need to use these guys to catch up. So just going to bump draft with Lando here. And we're going to pull. Okay, good. We're now going to kind of pull out of the slipstream a bit, then go back in. There we go. We're gaining, we're gaining, we're gaining. Going to let Lando go there into the break zone. It's three wide and Leclerc goes for the lead. Bottas does down the inside. We're up into P4, but Leclerc in the Ferrari are bat is battling the Red Bull. This is what happens with 100 slipstream and no dirty air. You get the Ferraris getting in there and you get this four wide for P1 and we've got, what's this, eight cars co literally covered by half a second. You could literally 
literally throw a blanket over them. And we're here. And we're ready. And Hamilton. Oh, spicy. Hamilton Verstappen side by side here. We're going to get in the middle of it, though. And we're going to get up into P4 again. But crucially, this time, we've closed up to Bottas. Now, we're in prime position to lurk around for a move for P1. Now, crucially, it's you want to be second place as we get to this part of the circuit to get P1 right at the death. So playing this tactically, but that's going to, uh, you know, allow, allow some pressure from Marvin Hamilton. But this is just going to change constantly the lead as we go nearly 4-1 to turn one. It's three wide into turn one for the race lead this is, remember. Leclerc back into it. We're just kind of watching on with a bucket of popcorn. We'll go around the outside of Bottas there with a lack of dirt air. Easy to do that. Gaining on Leclerc as well as we push it in and he's side by side with Perez right now we're gonna do Bottas there at the hairpin and then watch on right easy does it right those guys are gonna catch me I'm gonna let off the throttle on purpose here gonna bump draft Leclerc let's go DRS open doubt that's gonna really do too much but look at this <laughs> 280 miles per hour and we're basically bump drafting Formula 1 cars Love it, love it. Right, well, I was neutral there for a second. That's calm. Switch back of dreams on Perez. Look at the racing going on here. We'll take the lead for a bit. I don't mind that. We're into the lead for a tiny bit. For how long, though? Perez comes back. Bottas comes back here. It's three wide. Perez is there. It's four wide even, maybe. It was. It was. That was four wide for the race lead. Insanity. We're going to just let them get through there. Don't want to get cut off. Oh no, Hamilton. It's not even it's not even Bottas. Bottas got pushed down the order. This is Hamilton that's got back into the mix of things. Take it easy. Oh my days. Mamma mia, Perez living dangerously there. Leclerc's actually holding on though. Really well. Is Leclerc is he a, is his AI gonna be, you know, a, a surprise as the uh, best man at this sort of new formula, you know? Certain characteristics you need. Maybe Leclerc has them. You know, just a bit of patience involved. Holding the ship steady as we go four abreast into turn one. This is going to keep on going and keep on going, I think. As we are now on lap four. And we're battling once again with Leclerc. And oh my god, Hamilton. Jesus. Came out of nowhere. And just bumped me off. We lead our teammate by nine seconds. Okay, calm, easy. Right, I'm still in shock at what Hamilton just did there. That was, that was out of nowhere, right. Look at this. Leclerc and me are going to get such a toe. We're going to get Perez. Oh, yeah, yeah. My teeth are... You know, you thought lockups were bad for the teeth rattling for Formula 1 drivers. This is bad for teeth a teeth rattling. Going to have no... Not going to have any teeth left by the end of it as we squeeze out Hamilton, get back into first, but not going to be for long. We know how quick... They're going to close up. Hamilton gets us. Perez as well now. Going to let off on purpose. Let Perez through. Let Leclerc through. Let this just go on for another lap. We can take it easy as Leclerc and Hamilton are together. Easy goes. Just going to let them get away. Perez though. Oh, Perez has broken the toe, you know. That's a little bit worrying. We need to close up to Perez, lads. We need to be closing up to Perez. We are doing so, to be fair, because as we gain... Because there's no dirt here, like literally none. We gain slipstream in every corner. So we're just kind of together. We can maybe gain on Perez like this uh, in the corners. And then also, especially on the straights. But Leclerc, oh, he's a bit slow here, you know. These guys, I'm a bit worried here. I think Perez may have got away from us a little bit. Leclerc, come on, mate. Let's use you. Let's close. Close. We need to close to Perez. This is not what we need. Come on, mate. Come on. More, more, more. Through the corner. Nice. Keep going, mate. Oh, yeah, yo, yo. Bit of a wobble there. Perez is getting away from us, you know. This is a bit worrying. I think the Red Bull, we've been fighting so much, the Red Bull's got away from us, ironically. Perez just duped us. I think Perez has duped all of us. He's got us. We've got DRS here, but we're too busy in this fight. Can we gain time here? Come on. Come on. Gaining 215 miles per hour. Hamilton gains as well. But we're not gaining enough. Perez is there. But we need a bit more. We need more. Don't know if this is going to be enough, you know. I think Perez, the wily old fox, he's gotten away from us. 
and he's... He, oh, maybe not. Come on, Hamilton. Hamilton, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Right. Right, we've jumped it. we jumped away from them. We've gone for it. We've gone for it. We need to try and catch Perez. We might catch him. Going through the motions. We're catching Perez. We've caught him up just at the last corner. Could we do this? The dive bomb. Oh, we've got him, though, on the inside. No, he's back. Perez. No. Oh, Perez on the line. We couldn't quite do it. We couldn't did it. I mean, fair play. Fair play to him. His AI got away from us. We did very well, though, to get back to second place and just narrowly miss out on the win. But what a race with 100 slipstream and no dirt. Yeah, Yas Marina transformed. So Formula 1, I have your answer. It's not the new circuit. It's this. Just implement this. It's very simple. I know the physics may not exist and may not comprehend, but just get on it. You know, you've got some scientists behind the scenes. That was a lot of fun, though, guys. If you did enjoy it, hit the like button. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. If you're around here, then do get subscribed for weekly Formula 1 content. And I hope you guys enjoy, hopefully, what is a cracking championship finale tomorrow in real life for Abu Dhabi. Till then, guys. Hope you enjoyed today. Goodbye.